say is equal to home for me because um, for the past seven years, I think um, I've, how much of the time I spend at home, I spend that much time over here. And it's like I have a second family because I can talk to them about anything and everything and know that I won't get judged for it. production, getting our kids ready to go on stage, putting up a new play every year, it's the most exciting thing we ever do at PSS. And this is nothing less. Uh, people often ask me why Alibaba and the 40 Thieves, it's a story done so many times, people have seen it on stage, on film, I've read the story in so many versions of it. And uh, when I actually came across the script, I thought the same thing too, I thought it's been done so many times, maybe not. But then again I thought about it and I said, why not? Because it's so exciting to tell a story that is familiar in a new and unpredictable manner. And that was a challenge we had with Ali Baba. And I'm so glad we took that up because we have finally put together a story that is, though it is familiar and the audience knows what's, what probably might happen next, they're completely unprepared for the way it's unfolding. And so that has been a blast. Well, we've been doing plays for like now what? 11, 13 years. 13 years. 13 years. Yeah. So many plays. And the thing about Alibaba is that this time I'm a singer. And usually I've been so like used to just being one of the principal actors and having the all these dialogues. And I always thought that, hey, this is very difficult. But then this year I was playing a singer and I'm a citizen at the back. And I just came to realize how much harder it is to, as Ruth and would always say, to act without a line. I was thinking about you, thinking about me, thinking about us, what we gonna be, open my eyes, it was only just a dream, travel back, down that road, will you come back, no one knows, I realize, it was only just a dream. so excited we were here nine o'clock sharp waiting for Adi to come we already knew we were going to be performing Alibaba and the 40 thieves and we were so excited and as we as when we got deeper into the script and we finished our blocking and everything we realized that this was going to be a very different play because Adi has just taken things to the next level and I got to play Salma and performing with Hasan is a huge opportunity and Aunty's trusted me with this big role and I'm so excited and she's helped me at every step of the production process and it's just been amazing. I've been in PSSC for like 8 years now and Aunty's literally like a mother to me and I love her so much and I love this place and it's my home and this is the place I get to be free. So, it's now been almost 36 hours without sleep and uh, we are going pumping on adrenaline and it's always like that before show and so energy is a little low right now but I know in another half an hour before the lights are going to come up 
we'll all be in our A game and so will I. You need to just put on the slap on the makeup, put on your best smile and get your A game out. But uh, I think staying up the night in the auditorium is for me the most exciting part of doing a production because it's for me it's the culmination of everything that I have visualized and was thus far just a vision when I see it coming to life that's a really exciting thing for me. I imagine the sets, I dream of what it's going to be and I, and I explain it to my set designer. I dream of what my stage should look like and how it should be lit in each scene and uh, the mood of each scene and little things like when I want a moon to go up and uh, whether I want a spotlight in a window or not and uh, small gestures like this time set is completely hilarious and I took great pains to not just Indianize it but to give it that very very colloquial flavor so the food cart is my prized possession on stage because it's hilarious and I worked very hard on figuring out the menu and the spellings on the menu particularly so the little touches that you add to the stage and what happens is one night before show when the set is being erected and they're putting it together, you actually see your vision, you know, piece by piece. It's like different pieces of a jigsaw puzzle finally falling into place. And you see that happening. And uh, it, is in, it is extremely important for me to be there at that time because there are a lot of corrections that you make as, uh, as it's unfolding. I'm very freaked out about what will happen backstage, but I trust my team and I know they do a good job. And um, yeah, I this place is made me the person I am today and Role on stage, 
and I've realized that backstage is a whole different ball game from being on stage, and it's a whole new world, and it's so different from what I would have thought backstage was. And I've realized that there's so much work to do that that happens behind the scenes, and I never actually acknowledged all of the work that gets put into a play before I actually. Started doing this production was really amazing and very different from the ones we've done before um, because it's much more Indianized here. I'm playing a princess and she is very snobby and uh, you know she's she's not the nicest person in the world. And eventually, when I came to practice and I started doing my scenes, you know, it was really great that she trusted me and you know she had enough faith in me and she knew that I could do it. So thank you, Auntie, and thank you for all the help you've given to me. And yeah. hi, I'm Vaishnavi. I've been in BSSD for eight years, and this is my seventh production. Um, VSSD is like my second home. I love coming here. Zulfiyani is like my second mom. Um, I feel I feel very comfortable being here in VSSD. Uh, VSSD has helped me a lot. It's removed my stage fright, given me confidence. Um, Alibaba and Forty Thieves is a, it's a very special play because I'm doing backstage as well as acting. So it's it's very nice. I'm looking forward to do many plays here at VSSD. Um, good luck to VSSD. <laughs>
Alibaba, I was super excited because it's the first time that we've done a play that's so truly Indian and is relevant to our today. Um, the audience seemed to love it too because it was an exaggeration based on the reality that they knew and it was a caricature that they so readily wanted to accept. When you do a play, uh, it's always an amazing experience. But when you do a play with BSSD, it's very different. Because when you finish it, you always come out bolder, braver, more confident. And because of the kind of people you do it with, you come out a kinder individual. The play is a transformative process, right from the beginning to end. And I don't think anyone, the cast, crew or the audience can say that after their journey down the street with a thousand scooters, they came out the same. Ladies and gentlemen, not only, not only one of our strongest actors, but the music arranged and sourced and arranged by Hasnain, all the choreography done by Hasnain. So thank you so much, thank you so much. Thank you for being the best Alibaba we could have had. Thanks once again. You are the best audience ever. Bangalore, thank you so very much. We will keep doing what we're doing. So we're going to be back next year, same place, same time. Till then, have a great life. <laughs>